Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and uh, we have a new Google Chrome web browser and um, some of you might not have it yet. It's taking long, longer to roll out than previous versions. You can actually go download it directly if you want it right now. But if you do have it already um, or if you wonder if you can get it, just go into the upper right corner in the three uh, vertical dots help and about Google Chrome, you will be moved to version 99. So version 99, as we are close to the version 100 coming in uh, four weeks from now, as the Google Chrome browser now updates every four weeks. So this new version does not have a lot of new stuff. One is if you download files, you might have a download icon in the taskbar. It's gonna be gray while it's downloading and it's going to become green when the file is downloaded and you can click there to actually go to the download. So uh, a download shortcut basically that's appearing up there with the icons in your taskbar. Um, web apps now will be able to use a system date picker that it's available through Chrome. So any app that requests it, the uh, app will actually have the date picker which, you know, it's one of those pop-ups with a calendar in it where you can click a date and it will be applied to um, a website for example uh, developers apparently have asked for this a long time ago and by the way the download icon is an icon that's kind of uh, stolen to Microsoft Edge if you want in a way uh, if you do handwriting well there is going to be a recognition of the handwriting through the Google Chrome browser also so anything that has to do with that is going to be um, recognized to the best of the ability of the handwritten recognition API. They're, man they're phasing out Manifest V2 for ad blockers as there is now uh, introduced, of course, the uh, Manifest V3 in 2020. And so uh, this means that uh, for if you use a ad blocker, um, it may not be as good as it used to be. Uh, V3 allows extension to have a max of 30,000 rules, so um, it's kind of uh, breaking a little bit ad blockers uh, in, some, in some way, basically. Apart from that, uh, dark, the um, color scheme of dark mode and so on is followed on more of the system in within Google Chrome and following the rules of your system um, you know, on Mac or Windows or Android. Um, there's also uh, some battery status API that no longer supported uh, in it. And there's a few things for developers. But overall, for the average user, nothing much. What is mostly important is that there are security fixes, 28 security fixes in here. So if you don't care about new features, at least move to 99 for the security fixes. Uh, so remember, just go to Google Chrome, upper right corner, help, and about Chrome, and you'll be moved to 99. If you don't see it, you can also go to the Google, uh, download.google.com and download it directly from there. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.